New research by Osteopathy Australia has found that one in six Australians are living with chronic pain every day. Most wouldn't seek the help of a health professional until they were unable to move. But our next guest says getting help early changed her life and it allowed her to defy the odds after a shock diagnosis. Tamara Watkins was 28 years old with three children when she received a life-changing arthritis diagnosis. A bone spur was growing into her spinal cord, causing headaches, vomiting and shooting pains. Doctors said she needed two high-risk disc replacements and advised her not to have any more children. But while waiting for surgery, Tamara started osteopathic treatment, getting regular massages and stretching. Her remarkable improvement means she hasn't needed a second operation in 13 years. She returned to work full time, and even better, she was able to welcome a fourth baby into their growing family. Well, Tamara joins us now from Melbourne. What a turnaround, Tamara. Take us back to that initial diagnosis. What was it, going through your mind? It was tough, it was really tough. It was, I had three babies and I didn't know what my life was gonna even remotely look like. And uh, it was from my osteopath who pushed to get that diagnosis as well. And simply, you know, we, we fought and fought and fought and found a surgeon who was, who was willing to, I guess, operate and, and give me this second chance at life. So how did osteo help you? Just the stretching, the regular treatment, um, I guess both mentally, physically and emotionally, I found an amazing osteopath who, you know, even after my first visit, she rang me the next day to make sure I was okay. And, you know, some, day, some weeks I'd see her twice a week and then we went out to sort of six to, to every six to eight weeks, which we, start, we still are at now. Um, but she was amazing. Absolutely yeah. amazing. Yeah, I've, I've got an osteo and just regularly go for a tune-up. And it's amazing what stretching and exercise can do because a lot of people believe, say, for example, arthritis can only be treated with medication. Not at all. I, I mean, in the early days, I was prescribed lots and lots of, you know, those heavy drugs and everything else, and we got through the operation, and it was tough. Chronic pain is tough, yeah. and uh, the medication was, was probably a mixture of all of that. Um, I, I mean, it's been a long time now since I've had to be on those, and just working with the osteopath and, um, you know, regular Pilates, uh, mm. uh um, remedial massage, everything. So it's a mm. real combination. Um, the other big thing is just surround yourself with positive people, mm. whether it's from the doctors right through to your family, right Be through to your friends. Because when you were given that initial diagnosis, you were told by doctors, weren't you, that you shouldn't have a fourth child. I've Absolutely. And I was content at the time. It wasn't till. You know, I sort of got into my late 30s and I met a, a new amazing man and, you know, I had three beautiful, very healthy children. It was only through meeting him and him sort of saying, you know, what about an, a, a child? He didn't have any. And I had to have that conversation with my osteopath and say, how are we going to do this? And uh, and she got me through and a whole team got me through. And now, you know, I have this emo most amazing six-year-old little girl who yeah. just completes our family. It's a lovely story. It is, isn't it? Yeah, really uh, interesting yeah. for a lot of people, I think, to, to seek help outside um, if they can, and often in conjunction with other treatments. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Thank you very much. Great story, Tamara. Fabulous. Thank you. Nice to meet you.